remember about those two games against Arizona last year? Um, well, obviously it was great to get the win, um, but the crowd, the crowd was phenomenal. They have a good crowd out there. And the atmosphere is great. Um, but, you know, we have one goal in, in the mindset is to go out there and get the win. But, uh, you know, that was, that was the one I, the thing I took away is always to get, get a win in Tucson. Did it's you get easy. more juice out of that game? Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, a long history, um, you know, kind of like a little rivalry game. Um, it's, a, it's a fun atmosphere. And, um, you know, to always get the win, whether it's, you know, in Tucson or somewhere else, you know, it's always great. Where do you talk a little bit sweeter? Sorry, what do you tell your teammates who haven't played there before about, like, how to handle that environment? Um, just how um, the atmosphere is, is kind of crazy, but it's just a one game at a time. It's just like another game. Um, obviously, there's a little bit more to it just because of, like I said, the history. But, um, you know, as far as in the atmosphere, just treat it like a regular game. And um, just make sure it's fun because you get to stay, um, stay disciplined. And as a group, you get tighter because you have to figure out ways to win the, win the game, especially when the atmosphere is, uh, you know, is like that. What do you make of this stretch? You start off the conference play at Arizona, then you go to the Oregon yeah. schools, and then come home against Colorado. That's that's pretty difficult to start out conference. Yeah, it's pretty difficult, but it's it's, it's fun, man. This is what we this is what everybody wants to play basketball because of those competitive competitive games, and it's a uh, you know those are great teams, um, coach very well, and you know I enjoy it, man. This is my third year doing it, and it's just this is the most fun I've ever had. When you came in here, coming from SoCal, did you? understand what this rivalry was? Um, just a, a little bit, a little bit. I know at the, at the time, um, I think Arizona was kind of on top. You know, they were majority of the time will win, but um, now just being a part of it and uh, being on top is, is, is fun. I mean, um, kind of, you know, we do this ceremony before uh, every season starts with all sports teams and, you know, we get an award for beating um, Tucson and I got to uh, go up there and show, share the award. Um, because beat them twice, right? We sweep them, so that was that was awesome. So we just, I'm just looking forward to you know going back on all season and you know, getting that work. Do you think you do you sense that they're going to be a little bit even more fired up because you did sweep them last year? Of course, I know. Um, you know, probably as a probably a coach is you know putting fire under them, letting them know that hey, this is they got us you know the last two years and you know saying that they're, that's this is their state and everything, but uh, you know. We're gonna, at the end of the day, it's 40 minutes. You know, we have to be better than 40 minutes, so it'd be great. A couple of the freshmen are from Arizona high schools. Do you feel like they fully understand their rivalry? Um, I don't know because when you're, you know, when you're in that atmosphere, um, it's totally different. Like you forget about everything because it's so, you know, the, the energy is so amazing. Um, they probably know a little bit more than you know I did, but at the end of the day, we're gonna treat it like another game and we try to keep winning. What do you know about Nico Mangan? I don't know much, but I know that he's a great player. You know, I, I hear that, you know, he's a very good player. Obviously, he's from Arizona. And, um, you know, uh, we're going to have our um, defensive adjustments for him. And, you know, I just know he's a great player, and uh, we'll see uh, on Saturday. What are the style, you know, tendencies uh, of Arizona that you have to be keep in mind when you play them? Um, that they're very disciplined. They're very disciplined. Like, uh, they take a lot of charges as well. Um, but as long as we got you know, counter moves to that, but they're a very, um, you know, disciplined team and they, you know, they have a lot of talent. Um, and those, throughout the years, they've always been disciplined and have a lot of talent. Rob got off to such a great start and just these last few games, he have not seen look like himself. What do you guys got to do to take control? Um, just let it, we, we got to let the ball come to him, you know. Uh, dude, I know that dude put in so much work. Um, he's gone through a lot with his injuries and he's, consistently getting in the gym and working hard. Um, and in basketball, we all go through these things and we all have slumps. And, you know, he's going through one right now and it's shown, but it's gonna turn for him because he put in so much work um, that, you know, once he once it turns, he's gonna be scary for other teams. Is there anything especially important to get you, Zoe and Rob kind of all firing on all cylinders at the same time? Right, yeah, and I think that we all have the right attitude towards it. I mean, we're just waiting for that, you know, moment. Um, we're consistently working on it. We're, you know, communicating, and we know, like, Rob's like, hey, man, I'm off, you know, and we, we in communication, we're, we're true about it, and um, that's the thing. We face it, and as soon as it turns, it's going to be fun. As January is here, do you feel like you have a good idea of what this team is, or are there more questions than there have been, say, last year? 
Um, I've always been, you know, pretty much confident in, you know, my team. Uh, you know, whether it's, you know, other people have, you know, other opinions on it. Um, I'm always like kind of the same, even when it's off season, even when we're doing bad, because I feel like I see um, a lot going for us, and I feel like I'm here every day in practice and getting to see what we have. Um, so my mind, like, I'm always trying to stay positive, always like trying to, uh, you know, see it turn because at the end of the day, I'm with these guys, I'll go to war with any of them, and I know it'll turn.